you guys. Happy Wednesday. I hope you're doing well. Okay, today's going to be a bit of a tough love Wednesday, I guess. Um, I have messages again, which I think are coming from the eclipses, which I think is good. Okay, it's a positive, but it's a, it's a tough love positive. More of a karmic kick in the ass kind of positive, okay? We come in with the lover card. Okay, we've got the Nine of Swords, the Five of Wands, and the Judgment card. I think what you're really being asked to do here is uh, do what you love and love what you do. That includes the people around you, um, the choices that you make for yourself in all areas. Um, if you think that a lifestyle that truly makes you happy, you're not living because you're not sure how it's going to be accepted or, and that goes from A to Z. That's anything. That could be a profession that, that you're not quite sure about, or it can be, um, you know, a partner or it could be anything, but, but you're really being asked to just, uh, get out of your head the, uh, self-defeating ways of thinking about things, that you're not good enough, that, you know, this won't work. Get all of that out of your mind and realize that there is nothing that you are limited to. Anything that you want to do, anything that makes you happy, anything that you want to experience, um, leave, you know, all the negative connotations behind and step into it because this judgment card here on the outbound is telling you that now is the time. So that leads me to believe, and I know this feeling well, is that it's when we circle the bend and circle the bend and circle the bend and we just, we either don't uh, think we can do it. There's something that stops us from going forward. Whatever that is to you, you're being told now that now is the time where you really need to to really just hear the call and to step into it because without doing that when we get this card there are consequences if we don't step into it um, and it's different for everyone so I think that this is um, a great throw it's a it's a card to, it's a throw I should say to really get you out of whatever it is that has held you back right so just realize that you're loved you're wanted because there's something in this reading too where I think someone is feeling like uh, they're not sure why they're here. They're not sure why they were born. They think they weren't wanted or aren't loved. That's crap. Okay. It's, it's absolutely crap. So that's what this reading is, is telling to you. Crap wasn't my message, but that was the word that I put in there because it, it's just not true. That was the actual message. It's just not true. Okay. So you're here, you serve a purpose. So live the life that you want to live. Um, and again, it's about you and not a zillion other people, right? So, so step into that because what this card is really telling you is now's the time, right? The universe, like we say, we have free will, yes, but at a certain point, the universe is going to step in and say, enough, we've seen really what you can do here and you're not doing it. So now we're going to do it for you. So it's a good thing. It gets you where you're going regardless, but when you make these steps, it's a little less bumpy because not that we have control over much, but we feel like we do, right? So whatever is happening here, if you're holding yourself back in some regard, you're not living the life that's truly yours, um, you're being asked to really just, to just do that, okay? So there you have it. I hope that I helped you in some way. If you need a private reading, please reach out to me. I will be more than happy to do that for you, okay? Thank you so much.